Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Fallout 3 Wanderers Edition. So, we are at this power substation. Uh, Fox and Cross are both badly hurt, but they'll be fine in a minute. Whoa, okay. What the hell? Is that a rad scorpion? Where did that come from? Okay, anyways, um, we are also running kind of low on bullets as you can see, uh, and health. So what we're gonna do is we are going to head... Where's Paradise Falls? We're gonna head back to Paradise Falls to our motorcycle, which is currently full of ammo and other various things that we can use. And we are going to heal up and stock up on gear, and I'm also actually going to... Yeah, I'll stim pack myself as well. There we go. Get ourselves up decently. Alright, come on, lazy bones. Let's get going. Oh, I can't hop over Fox. Okay. Oh, right. These guys have a bunch of stuff on them that we may as well take. Bunch of contracts to kill me as well, the jerks. Hi. Victory. Okay. Well, that was weird. Where did that Gatling laser fire come from? I mean, it wasn't aimed at us or anything, but... Alright, whatever. Ah, there's Paradise Falls. And a guy. Oh, no, you're a girl. You don't seem to be shooting at me, which is nice. But what are you doing all the way out here? Probably a hunter. And there's laser fire down the way. Slaver? Yes. Well now. That, uh... That changes things. How much ammo do I have for my pistol? Ooh. I got a better idea. Yeah, this will do. Hi. Slavers. Okay, that's a long ass reload animation. Okay, I'm gonna borrow these and your finger. And uh, I'm actually gonna take this. Because I feel like we have a bunch of 30 odd 6 ammo. And I can probably give the bar to Fox and then he can use it. I've got a gun with ammo in it, just in case whoever's got laser weapons down here doesn't like me. That's a death claw. Well, ah, okay, I guess there was another death claw. Oh, shoot, we're gonna be back with the town company guys again. Hi, town company. I need my gun. I need my gun. Star Paladin Cross is already unconscious. Stop trying to set me on fire, please. This is not going very well. Hi, Talent Company. Okay. Really not going very well. Okay, run for cover over here. Okay, this is a little bit safer. Now I can get my gun out. We good? Is my Pip-Boy light on? No. Whoa! Who's shooting at me? Who? 
where? What is happening? I'm so sad right now. Wrong way. I really need to get Fox and uh, Frost guns they can actually use so they're not trying to melee things to death. Anybody else? Somebody's firing a Gatling laser. Which concerns me. Although, there's a Gatling laser, there might be energy charge cells. Oh, it's a sentry bot. It's a hostile sentry bot. Okay. Uh, that's not great. And you can try fighting. You know, I should probably just duck back inside real quick. See if I can make talent companies stop chasing me. Yeah, I'm not going to bother fighting the sentry bot. At this range, he's just going to, like, hit me with a missile launcher and I'm going to die. Alright, let's grab some stuff off these guys. Shotgun shell. Fingers. Where's the other guy? He's over here. There you are. Take all that stuff. Okay. We're going to wait a second. I don't like that the sentry bot is still showing up. But he seems to have left. I think we're okay. Alright, I'm going to wait a second for Fox and Cross to stand back up. Then we're going to go back inside and come out so that we can stop fighting Talent Company over and over again. Hopefully there's not another Talent Company group there. There we go. All right, let's head back inside real quick. And back out. Oh, where? Oh, there you are. And back out. Huzzah, we're not being damaged by Talon Company. Okay, good. Now we can stop fighting Talon Company every friggin' time we die. And, uh... We should still probably... Eh, oh, let's push on. Think we can make it we're not that far from where we need to be i don't think I, I can't select another quest though there we go yeah so we need to go up there it looks like our best bet is actually to go like kind of around and up that way but it's kind of hard to tell the map is not terribly helpful for that kind of thing what are we fighting is that a bloat fly that is absolutely a blood fly. Good work, Star Paladin Cross. You showed him who's boss. Alright, uh, we need to sneak past these satellite arrays because our destination, I was looking on the map, is actually basically due north of them. So, hang on, we can kind of work out. Kind of triangulate where we are. Okay, so, there's the three satellite arrays. Yeah, so we want to basically be around them such that that one is just slightly to the side of that one. And then if we head away from them, we should find out where we're going. Just for that. Okay, so this is probably... I think we want to go up this. It's probably up on that slope up there. If we just kind of go this way, we can... As long as we can see the towers, we can kind of work out where we need to be. Hostiles? I don't like the sound of that. Oh, no. I don't think I have a whole lot of this ammo left. It's kind of a problem. Come on then. I mean, I have a ton back at the bike, but the bike is. Leave me alone. Um, the bike is far away. That's what I was trying to say. Energy cells, missile, and missile launcher. We can give that to Fox if he's alive. He has a good heavy weapon skill. I'm not going to bother taking the rest of this stuff, though. I'll take the energy cells, because we can use those for our, uh... 
for our cloaking device, which we should probably get a little bit more use out of, honestly. How about you guys? Fingers I'll take. Fingers. Ooh, has a single bullet for a gun he doesn't own. Fantastic. You guys okay? You look kind of dead. Ooh. Yeah, okay, Fox is dead. Cross is fine. This is a lot of radiation we're taking right now. I'll take a plasma grenade. Okay, just run across here real quick. This guy doesn't have anything. I guess other people took his stuff. Alright, well, Fox died. Uh, that's unfortunate. Uh, Fox did not die. I guess, actually, I think Fox is... I don't think Fox can die. I'm not positive of that, but I think he's actually, like, important to the story, and so he can't be killed. Ah, uh, man, we are just out of bullets for everything. Except our pistol. And our shotgun. Okay, there's another radio tower, which actually looks like it is exactly where we're trying to head to. So that's a good sign. How do we get up there, though? No, that looks like a dead end to me. That is definitely a dead end. Okay, uh, loop around this way, I guess. Oh, this also is a dead end. I guess we gotta get over... Oh! Nope, oh, that doesn't look like we can get to that. Hmm. Maybe we can climb up this and have our party members kind of AI path their own way up here. Nope, oh, too steep. Alright, well. I guess we gotta circle around those rocks there. Hey, long play about those down there, which we are gonna avoid like the plague. Okay, well... Thank you for your help with those guys. They finally tracked me down. I thought I'd have more time. You've come about the broadcast, right? Risky, I know. But it had to be done. So you know who I am. Who are you? Uh... I'm a better fighter than you. Um, I came because the radio message was wrong. That's not really an answer to his question, but we're gonna go for it anyways. Well now, a hero. Look at you. I come from a place far to the northwest. It's called the Pit. It's, well, let's be honest. The place is a nightmare. Radiation, mutation, disease. But the worst of it, my people, some of the only survivors, are slaves. No big deal, you're thinking? It's a rough world, but I have a chance to free them. All I need is an outsider's help before that chance is gone. That's rough, buddy. Um, if your people need you, what are you doing here? That's pretty obvious. He's here to find someone. Did you escape or something? Yeah, that's why these guys were after me. As long as I know about the cure, I'm a threat. So I ran. And you can be damn sure there'll be more of them coming. Uh, cure for what? The pit's a mess. Nearly everyone who lives there is either sick, dying, or worse. It's the water. And the air, you can't escape it. You stay there a few years, and no matter what, it'll get you. But the bastards who have my people, they found a way to cure it. And once they have that cure perfected, we don't stand a chance. So we need the cure to bargain for our freedom. Uh... Okay, why am I involved in this? What do we need to do first? Well, you might try a disguise. They probably won't let some random armed waster pass the gates. But if you look like one of the working stiffs, you should be able to slip in with no problem. Lucky for us, a group of slavers is nearby waiting to make a sale. You should be able to get one off of them. They're off to the west, near the tunnel that leads to the pit. That should be our first move. Uh, yeah, sure. Disguise sounds like a good idea. Okay, you go get the outfit. I'll stay here and meet up with you when it's done. I'll meet you up by the tunnel that leads to the pit. You go get whatever you'll need for the trip. 
You won't be coming back here for a while, so keep that in mind. All right. Now, interestingly, we heard that same gun that we heard before. The really ludicrously loud one. Which, now that I'm hearing it again, I think is just bugged. And the audio plays as if it's right next to you at all times. Werner's just going to hang out here and let us do all the hard work. Now, he said to the west. So we are currently... What direction is even west? We're right there. I know my cardinal directions. West is this way. Okay, so... That would be... That way, because we can see the satellite towers. Um... Our problem is that we don't have a whole ton of ammo to pull this off with. So I guess we better hope these raiders are not terribly well equipped. Caution is advised. Well, at least we can make some use of our stealth suit now. In fact, uh, let's tell these guys to just hang out here for a bit. I'll tell them to come join me in a minute. I think we can maybe sneak up on these guys and take them out without too much fuss. Is that where we... Nope, there... Where do we need to be? I don't actually see a tunnel anywhere around here. Uh, Alright, we're gonna have to get the quest thing going again because I have no idea where we're trying to be. Acquire a slave outfit. Oh, wow. That is a far ways to the west. Okay. Uh, new idea. You guys can actually follow me, because I might need you for something else. Once we get a little bit closer, I'll tell them to hang out. Well, there's a protector on down there, who is hostile, but I don't think they can actually see us. Uh, we're getting closer. Jeez, this is far away tunnel, Werner. Oh, I think the protector spotted us, but whatever. We can't do anything. As long as Fox and Cross don't jump down the cliff to fight him, we should be fine. Oh, this is the edge of the map. Okay. So we'll climb up here. Because we actually can't walk around that little rocky bit there. Okay, I assume that structure over there is the tunnel we need to get to. Because it's at least going in the right direction. Ooh. Contact. What? What's going on? I don't see anybody. We're not playing the combat music. Is that the Protectron? It, it is. Fox just went and sledgehammered it. Okay. Anywho. Uh, I... Oh, and then it exploded. I guess we need to get down this cliff. And then I'll probably have Fox and Cross wait in this little valley down here. And I will sneak over. Let's see if we can't stealth our way through some of this. Cross fell down the cliff. Okay. Alright. You guys just chill out right about here, I guess. Bad, not a bad spot. Actually, why don't you relax? There you go. Hopefully they don't walk into line of sight of whoever's at the camp. Now, we have... A stealth field that we can activate, which is on um, that button, which also tells us the field of view, so that's convenient. And we've got, let's see, it's 10 seconds per energy cell, and we've got 300 energy cells, so we've got a fair amount of time. Something Felix is bugging out up ahead. Alright, we may as well stealth field now. Fox. Please don't die. Are they not hostile? Huh. Well, that's going to make things easy. I'm just going to... They are actually not hostile to me. Maybe it's just because they can't see me. I don't know. Anyways. Thunk. Ow. Okay, well, that went too late. 
They can, in fact, see me. Ow. Ow, this hurts. Okay, well, my stealth field wore off. Uh, anywho. Hey, guys, if you want to just, uh, come join in the fun. I suspect Fox is already doing so. Keep firing, you say? Oh. I can't jump from here, which is kind of a problem. There we go. It's my... Stealth hit on. Where are these guys? Keep firing. I hear him. Take her out. Is he stuck in the rock or something? There's a bunch of slaves over there. Where is this guy? Did I hit her? Oh, there he is. Hey, there's more. They're having trouble finding me. Which is interesting. Hi. Oh my god, no, they're just stuck in the rocks. Okay. Well, that's awkward. Oh, shoot, we're gonna be all the way back to the friggin' place again. On the upside, no talent company hanging out this time. Which is always nice. This is where we got trumped by those Enclave guys last time. But I think we're in the clear. Oh, never mind, there they are. They're really inaccurately throwing grenades at me. Oh no. I swear to god. I'm just trying to travel, like, friggin' 200 meters. Like, we're not even- we're not even that far from where we need to be. Look at that. Look at how close we are. We just keep dying over and over again. Alright, well, I guess this is where I'm gonna call it for today. At least we're- we won't have to deal with these talent company guys anymore, which is nice. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.